I'm looking at some of the country's finest thugs. And of course, young Mozart in a go-kart over there. People love great bank robbery stories. I'm just gonna sit back and talk fashion. I know a movie's about cars, <laughs> but yeah, you guys look great. I love it when you get the memo. Like, you come to the junket hot. We did it well today, we did. Make a statement. It's all, it's all good, but you could never drive in those outfits. No, but you see what outfit she drove in. I mean, you had some killer outfits yeah. and you were still like, You'd be surprised what women can do. Yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm never surprised at what women can do. Yeah. <laughs> Don't get, no, I, I, I'm pro woman. I, you guys are amazing. You can do all kinds of crazy stuff. It's, it's cool like that. But are, do you have skills actually behind the wheel? Well, I was just hearing from John Hamm about Aza's amazing driving oh, really? skills. So you, you, it's not so amazing. Oh. It's what do you just mean like it's not so regular. amazing? She just said you got props from my man. Nah, they, you no? were driving the getaway car. I, right? I drove. I mean, it was fun. We learned some stuff from the from the what, stunt amazing drivers? stunt drivers right, that cool, we had, cool. Jeff Fry, who's one of the best. And it was fun. I mean, we did learn a lot on set, didn't we? Yeah. All right. So, I what's the to... one thing you learned that you could apply in real life? Um, to be a waitress. <laughs> no, no, I'm talking well, about driving. I've worked in a pub before. I have worked, but have you worked in a pub before? Yeah, like pulling pints and stuff, but I've never been a, a waitress like serving food, so I was having to carry loads of stuff. I mean, actually, I wasn't really. It was all um, quite easy. I was going to say, you're a professional <laughs> But you know, actress, begging she honestly, she, she, she did an amazing uh, American accent, and I was like really impressed. You did an amazing job. I was like, ah. I would never be able to tell that you're British from watching it. No, no, no. The British always kill the American accent, but it They're does amazing. not work the other way around. I wish I could do it so <laughs> no, well. It does I'm not your good British at it. is pretty good. Uh, no, it you're being is. Is it? Well, what, hold on. If she's, a, if she's approving it, then it has to be pretty decent. It's not. It's like really cheesy and but my, try hard. My American's cheesy. It always sounds no. cheesy when it's not your own voice, I think. No, but you did you did do a good job. But here's here's the real question because it's all about fast cars and great music, which is why I love this movie. What's that one? One song that you hear while you're driving, you will automatically drive faster. Hmm. Mm. That's a good question. Good question. I don't know. I mean, uh, I have so many. <laughs> <laughs> like, like what? Yeah. Actually, I haven't driven in a really, really long time. I know what I'd always dance to. Okay, what do you always dance Donna to? Donna Lewis, I love you always forever. If that comes on, I'll oh, that's a definitely. Great so that's your, that's your personal party starter. That would be where I dance. But um, I don't know about driving. I Queen, the, the song Queen. is like. That, that works pretty good at the end of the movie, the Queen song. It's yeah, legit, that does know. work while you're behind the wheel. That's I weirdly, one. I weirdly get really excited with any Michael Jackson mm -hmm. song. Uh, and I would also, I like contrast, so I would probably choose like a slow song because it gives you like an edge of like okay, fast cars, that. but like that. some Barry White maybe in oh. there. Like it'd be, while you're driving? Yeah, because it's like a what kind nice of driving contrast. Are you you're like driving <laughs> fast, but it's smooth. It's a smooth drive. <laughs> Listen. Do you like, like when the very white comes on? We're doing letting the seat all the way back. I'm like, like in on, my really? mind, I'm in a movie set already. <laughs> <laughs> my my own. I'm my baby driver. Yeah, you are. I literally, exactly. like, like literally, that, that that can be <laughs> that can be completely <laughs> dangerous with the with the very white while you're while you're driving. Well, but no, this was this was a completely like fun movie to watch. So uh, how much fun did you have when you actually go back and watch? Because there's so much going on that it can't look the same while you're working as it does when it's finished. It was, a, I, it was amazing when I watched it the first time because obviously my stuff's quite contained in the diner and then when they all come in it's like and I'm like hit in the face with these amazing, amazing, terrifying characters. But when I saw the whole film and I was suddenly saw all the stuff in the hideout and all these incredible car chases and Aza like, like butchering a load of people with a machine gun, <laughs> I was just so blown away by it. I thought it was really exciting. so exciting, so cool, such incredible performances. Um, I can't believe I'm in such a cool film. It's sort of a yeah, bit I feel the same. Every time I watch it and, and, and they ask me, I get really excited. I'm like, it's so good. And I'm like, I shouldn't say that. I know. But it, it is good. And then I say, well, even if I wasn't in it, I would like it as well. And it's you very know? ensemble. So, you know, you, it's like, you. I feel like you can own going it's a brilliant movie without me being like, oh, I think I'm really good. It's like, uh, not exactly. about that. It's about this Edgar's film that is just so cool and so, you know, yeah, his amazing vision just putting on screen. And I think for me, the most exciting part was also like the gun prepping, because it looks really easy as me as a, as a spectator, right? When I'm watching a movie and I see all these, Charlize Theron, for example, with shooting guns, it looks very easy. And you think it's like a plastic gun and then you get to set and it's a real gun with just like not Lanks real bullet, yeah. blanks, exactly. And so 
when I had to like raise those um, machine guns, you know how machine gun goes. So I was like, oh, Everyone's I think ducking. I really, yeah. <laughs> I need to train for this and I had to. I physically had to train a lot and kind of like get into my zone. So that was an interesting and fun, exciting process because I had never gotten the chance to do that before. Do we do this thing or not? I have to end this. 